Why is it that all of our favorite things, red wine, olive oil, coffee, seem to create the worst stains? I'm Katie Holdefer, and this is Spotless. In this series, I'm gonna show you two ways to get rid of even the worst stains. First, we'll start with a simple hack using stuff that you probably already have around your house. And then we're gonna step up the stain fighting power and I'll show you a more involved remedy that will get out even stubborn stains. So today we're talking about a scenario that is not the most pleasant to imagine, but it can easily happen in the kitchen. It's Sunday, you're getting ready for a busy week and you're meal prepping. You're chopping veggies when, ouch, you realize that that wasn't a bell pepper that your knife just cut into. In your rush to the sink, you accidentally get a drop of blood on your white shirt. So what can you do? In this episode, we're gonna start with hydrogen peroxide, an oxidizing agent that will break down the stain. And if that doesn't work, we're gonna try a more involved remedy that will get out even the toughest of stains. And bringing in my shirt. Okay, so I'm gonna take one of these and I'm gonna slide it underneath so that we don't end up getting the stain on the back of the shirt. Now I'm pulling in my hydrogen peroxide, which is what I'm gonna use to get this stain out. And then you just wanna pour a little bit on it. Oh wow, guys, this is magical. It's working so well. Then you wanna dab at it, but you wanna start from the outside of the stain and work your way in so you don't accidentally make the stain any bigger than it is. And look, that was pretty magical. The stain is entirely gone. I think if I throw this in the washing machine right now, it'll be completely removed. And voila, this just came out of the wash and the stain is fully gone, as you can see. Beautiful, looks good. Let's back up a second. This time the cleaning hack worked, but if you have a really set in stain, you may need to take it up a notch. Try this, look at that. Okay, is that, that's bad. Now I'm gonna add a little bit of Dawn dish soap. A little bit of ammonia. Carefully pour just a little bit of ammonia. And we wanna pull in our baking soda, sprinkle, just a nice even layer. I've let it sit for a little bit. I'm just gonna use a toothbrush. Let's rinse it and see what it looks like. Blood is a protein stain, so you wanna make sure when you're rinsing it out, you only wanna use cold water, not hot. Otherwise, it'll set it into the fabric. Okay, this looks great. Okay, I just gave it a quick rinse, and I think it's pretty much gone. All right. So I just pulled this out of the laundry, and as you can see, the stain is gone. I'm gonna fold it up. And just like that, it's good as new. Well, almost. If you want more stain fighting tips like this, be sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications so you won't miss a thing.